Cacti Beauties a Big Sister channel. How is everyone's December going? I hope that you have finished your Christmas shopping because we've literally got like a week to go. If you haven't, then check out my Christmas gift guide for all of the girly inspiration. I am so happy to say that I am done. All I've got to do now is wrap all my presents and I am finished. I am just enjoying spending time with my family and my friends and sunny. Even though it's come around really quickly this year, I feel like I'm really taking it in. I feel really, really Christmassy. Now, if you've been watching my channel for a while, you will know that rose gold is like my favorite shade in the whole wide world. And whatever I see in rose gold, I kind of have to get it. <laughs> now, when it comes to lipstick, rose gold is a shade that I have been wearing, I think, since last Christmas. And the first rose gold lipstick that I got was this one. At the time, no other brand really had a rose gold lipstick. But now, one year on, there are so many. There are so many brands to choose from for a rose gold lipstick. So I thought I would pick out a handful and test them out in this video. So if you do want a new rose gold lipstick, we are going to find the best of the best rose gold lipsticks in this video. We're going to kiss test them. We are going to selfie test them. There's a whole lot of testing that's going to go down. If you haven't subscribed already, then please do. If you want to become a beauty's little sister, then all the details will be below. And let's get in to testing these lipsticks. Who else loves minstrels? They are one of my favourite chocolates. I kind of, maybe might have eaten this whole bag. Oops. The first one that I'm going to show you is the OG, the one that I got a year ago, my first rose gold lipstick. This is the NYX Cosmic Metals Lip Cream in Speed of Light. I've included this in tutorials before. I have worn it so much and I know I love it. So this isn't really a test for me. This is more just to show you. <laughs> How amazing is this lip cream? Lip cream is such the right word for it. It's not drying at all. It feels really creamy on the lips, which I personally love. This lasts so well, and I just love the metallic sheen on the lips. It's so unique, it's so flattering. Literally, I think that anyone could wear this lip cream and it would look amazing. Also, it's really affordable as well. So this one for me, I haven't tested the other ones yet, but this one for me is a winner. Let's do the selfie test. I'm doing it on my Google Pixel 2, which is the best thing ever. And we're gonna kiss proof it. Now this, probably is going to transfer because it is a creamy formula, but here we go. You, you've got a full on transfer there. I think once it does settle down a bit, it does last for ages, you just get more of that matte finish. So it isn't as glossy as when you first apply it. But for me, when I've worn it, it does last for ages, but I'm quite impressed with that little lip print there. <laughs> I've just took off the NYX um, product with this Bare Minerals Oil Obsessed Total Cleansing Oil. I included this in my everyday skincare regime video. I use this like every day to remove my makeup. I've just used it on my lips and oh my God, they feel so soft. Next one I'm gonna try is the Ink Credible Foiling Around Metallic Lip Paint in My Dirty Brain. This is a beautiful copper rose gold. I love the packaging as well. It's a shorter wand than the next one. Let's try this. This definitely isn't as glossy as the NYX one. This is more matte. I feel like it was really easy to apply. This applicator is really precise and it doesn't overload the brush, so you can be really neat with it. The only thing that I'm not sure of is that you can see it separating in my picture. I can't really see it on here, but in my picture it's showing up. Hmm. Let's do the kiss test. Nothing has transferred at all. So for transfer, it's amazing. It's not gonna budge, but I don't like the fact that you can see it cracking. Mm, I'm not sure, guys. I am excited to try this one. This is the Ciate Liquid Chrome. So it is a rose gold, it's called Nova, but it's got like red and amber flare tones coming through it. It's a lot warmer and richer, but the iridescence looks incredible. This is really beautiful. I 
really love the color it's not like your typical rose gold if you want to go for the rose gold kind of vibe but you don't want to go classic this is a great color because it's just more orangey it's more flary it's like a sunset in a bottle <laughs> i am really impressed with this one okay let's selfie it now let's kiss it we've got the full lip transfer mm, this doesn't last as well it's looking a lot more faded now that i've kissed whereas when i kissed with the nyx one even though it transferred it still looked perfect on the lips whereas i feel like this one is a lot more subtle so with this one you might just need to pop up when you're out and about but as far as the consistency and the color goes i like it next up we have the jouer one this is the lip cream in papaya this is a lot lighter of a rose gold it's not as intense it's more of a subtle champagne rose gold now this is slightly more pricey i've heard a lot of good things about jouer though but I've never tried them, so let's give this one a go. The packaging is so cool. This colour is so unique. It's like a dusting of rose gold on my lips, like sugar coated almost. It feels really soft on the lips. It's really matte, but it's not drying. I don't know how to describe this. It just doesn't feel like you've got anything on your lips, really. I'm gonna do the selfie test. Mm. Yeah, it does look a lot more peachy in selfies. I think this is a nice, subtle way to wear rose gold. Let's do the kiss test. Tiny, tiny little bit. It's not even going to show up on camera, I doubt, because it's so faint. Impressive. How does it look now? It hasn't budged at all. So, you know I said I'm using that Bare Minerals Oil Cleanser. I just, like, balanced it on my mum's chair that I'm sitting on, and it might have stained it it's got like a ring of oil on her chair mm. i have two options i tell her and accept that she's just gonna hate me or i run away what do i do i don't know <laughs> why am i so clumsy it's not even that i'm clumsy i literally just balanced it on here i don't know how it's just stained how has the bottom of this got oil on it how <gasps> last but not least i can't remember if i've tried this in a video or not i know i've tried beauty bakery liquid lipsticks but i don't know if i've tried this shade but this is a waffle comb the reason i have left this till last is because it just doesn't come off does it you try beauty bakery you will know it is a nightmare to remove <laughs> Okay, Beauty Bakery. I think the shade is beautiful. It's a lot lighter than the true rose gold. So this is more of a champagne rose gold. The only thing about Beauty Bakery for me is that I find it's amazing if you're going out for dinner, if you're going for a long night out and you just know it's not gonna budge, it's brilliant. But for being comfortable, I just really don't like that matte effect. It is so, so dry. I love it, but it's just so dry. Mm, I just press my lip together and it's all like, separated i just don't think metallics work when it's this drying of a formula the metallic particles kind of seem to separate let's see what it looks like in a selfie let's kiss test it again it's just a the tiniest little bit of transfer but i don't feel like it looks that good on the lips now you can see where i've kissed like some of my the areas of my lips have lifted mm, i really like the color as i thought this one for me is five out of five stars it's the best the one i'm gonna put on now finish this video i just love it like you can see from me doing the bottom half of my lip to the top when i've said that it's a lighter like peachier toned rose gold you can see on the top it's a lot lighter whereas this is like more of a coppery color which i think is just a lot more flattering on my skin tone but i would so love to know what you think what is your favorite rose gold lipstick i have used in this video as i said the nyx just wins me all day every day i could wear this every single day and still love it also if there is a rose gold lipstick that i haven't tried in this video that you think i should have in my collection then please do let me know should i rate them from one to five i feel like that's a bit hard let's do it okay number one nyx number two jouer number three ciate I feel like these are so similar that they 
they should just draw. Thank you so, so much for watching this video. Please like and comment below. It would mean so much. It makes my day when I hear from you. It's just when you've worked on a video for so long, you've got ready for it, you've filmed it, you've edited it, and then you go to post it and you're really excited, and then no one comments in your life. Oh, so please drop me a comment and let me know how you are and how your Christmas is going and also if you haven't subscribed already then please please do subscribe become a beauty's little sister if you want to and I will see you in my next video bye